Oh, good morning. I'm precariously on time to get to the gym before the matinee, so the only logical thing to do is to go sit in front of the Christmas tree and make a video. Shadowy me, me. Ugh, I prefer, let's go halfway. Anyways, anyways, so let's discuss uh, Christmas shows that I love. Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer, Rankin and Bass in the mid-60s. This is a ridiculous video. I'm a ridiculous person. Oh, God. It's harsh and early. Anyways, Rankin and Bass. Uh, I love stop motion as an art form, as a, as a way to do things. I love it. I love it. I love it. So, but let's discuss Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer, a classic. I will watch it every year. I adore it. I adore it. I adore it. But let's talk about some of the things in it. Burl Ives as that snowman. I am sorry. I find him creepy. As a snowman or as a human, I find Burl Ives creepy. I, it probably has to do with that goddamn song he did, Lavender Blue, Dilly Dilly. What is Dilly Dilly? Ooh, it just sounds like you're diddling a child. I'm sorry, he's a pedophile. Even as a snowman, he looks like a pedophile. Oh, and why is he carrying an umbrella? It, is that like, okay, it is snowing and I'm a snowman. Is that the equivalent of like, oh no, there are skin cells falling from the sky. Give me an umbrella. Oh, there's DNA falling on me. I don't understand that. I just, it, even him sliding around there was a snowman with that mustache. Oh, he creeps me out. Anyways, so there's that. That just ruined that part for you. Let me ruin the rest. Uh, <laughs> Hermie the dentist. Herb, if Herbie wants to be a dentist, I love him. But here's the thing. That early stop motion stuff, there's not a lot of facial expression like when you see things now, uh, they're so advanced. Uh, if you turn the sound off while you watch it, and do this sometime, turn the sound off for a little while and just watch their mouths. Basically, the elves are going ee oo ee oo ee oo is all their mouths are doing the entire time. They have two mouths. ee oo ee oo I want to be a dentist. <laughs> it's so good. I love it. Then there's uh, Santa. Uh, okay, at one point, you really have to watch for this, and I think it's on Santa. It might be Yukon Cornelius. If you look, at one point, one of the hands on one of these things, or the, the set of hands, they're filthy. Like, they've been stop motion moving these puppets around for months, and they're just, there's no time to clean them. There's no time to replace them. I just had lunch. I ate coal. And, and you look, and it's like, oh my God, the, the hands are like, I mean, they're filthy. It's, it's unmistakable. You can almost see like a thumbprint in it. It's horrifying. Find it. I'm not kidding. Uh, and then there's the Island of Misfit Toys. I love the Island of Misfit Toys. First of all, I would love a water pistol that shoots jelly. I think that would be awesome. Here's the thing, people. On the Island of Misfit Toys is that little girl doll. Why is she on the Island of Misfit Toys? What's wrong with that little girl doll? You know what's wrong with her? I'll tell you what's wrong with her. She has a penis. To hand to God. If you watch, and at one point she twirls around and her little skirt goes up and you see a little peepee. -pee. That little girl doll has a penis and that's why she's on the Island of Misfit Toys. There, ruined that for you too, didn't I? Anyways, also ruined forever, the name Clarice, the little reindeer girl. There's always tomorrow. Her name is lovely, she is lovely, everything about her is lovely, and then Silence of the Lamb happens and it has ruined the name Clarice for all of us forever. So there. Anyways, <laughs> that's all I have to say about uh, Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer, which I adore, and I should be at the gym right now, so why, why are you listening to me right now? Stop watching so I can get out of here. Okay, bye.